the only man in this kingdom who can, but no questions asked. Los Angeles, Miami, San Francisco, Seattle, Denver, Boston, Chicago, Washington, D.C., and Dallas all report cases now. Gay people are living in wartime. Our friends are literally dropping dead around us while the rest of the world goes on as if nothing is happening. <laughs> The Education Secretary, Kenneth Baker, has demanded the banning of a school book about a little girl who lives with her father and his homosexual lover. Starting out as a writer, you were a black, impoverished, homosexual. You must have said to yourself, gee, how disadvantaged can I get? Oh, no, I thought I hit the jackpot. Oh, great. <laughs> <laughs> it was so outrageous, you could not go any further, you know. It had to be, it, so you had to find a way to use it. <laughs> The Bible clearly condemns homosexual practice, and all the arguments against that really are paper thin. Mrs. Thatcher is back in number 10 Downing Street tonight, Prime Minister for the third time in a row. What have I, what have I, what have I done to deserve this? What have I, what have I, what have I done to deserve this? What have I, 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 in clear English are being taught political slogans. Children who need to be taught to respect traditional moral values are being taught that they have an inalienable right to be gay. means that we won't have, you know, books on library shelves by Orton and Wilde. Uh, we, we won't have uh, films, gay films.
I do beg the government to think again and not create a loophole for busybodies, humbugs, and vindictive queer battlers. Yeah. Yeah. Three women gay rights protesters caused pandemonium in the House of Lords when they abseiled from the public gallery onto the floor of the chamber. The women were protesting that the Lords had approved a clause banning local councils from promoting homosexuality. Incredible, we just couldn't believe that this sort of thing was going on inside the House of Lords. Good evening, the headlines at six o'clock. In the House Stop of Lords, a vote is taking place now on a challenge to the Stop poll tax. Tory rebels have said... I do apologise if you're hearing quite a lot of noise in this studio at the moment. I'm afraid that um, we have rather been invaded. wish marriage was an option. Oh, no way. Oh. Fancy a nightcap? <sighs> Why not? Usual? Please. Two minutes. Right. Good night. Good night. But then you, 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 you came my way. What exactly did you object to? I object to seeing two grown men kissing on our television sets. I really think it's just gone too far. Thank you. 
you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Talk to me. Tell me your dreams. Am I in? Tell me your fears. Are you scared? Tell me your stories. I'm not afraid of who you are. We can fly. There's been so many innuendos and rumours and this, that and the other going on about my sexuality and about me over the years. And I thought that the situation was, let's be honest, there's so much hypocrisy, there's so many people who are not what they say they are. Can I kick it? Yes, you can. Uh, you can. Yes, you can. Can I kick it? Yes, you can. Can I kick it? Yes, you can. Can I kick it? Yes, you can. Uh, you can. Yes, you can. Can I kick it? Can I kick it to all the people who can quest like a tribe does? Before this, did you really know what I was? Comprehend to the track force. Why? Cause getting mentions on the tip of the vibe was. The practice of outing, which is threatened in Britain on a widespread scale this week, began in America. The urge to freak to the jitterbug. Come and spread your arms if you really need a hug. Afrocentric living gives a big shrug. A life filled with fun. That's what I love. A lower plateau is what we're above. The organization behind outing in Britain is FROX, Faggots Rooting Out Closeted Sexuality. This outing campaign was a hoax. The press have been hysterical about the outing campaign. For years, the media have regarded outing as their exclusive prerogative. This hysteria is motivated by sheer jealousy, greed, and homophobia. Things that make you go, hmm. 